Another manufacturer has released a laptop, equipped with an older chipset. In a world of silicon and graphics card hunger, Dell is looking at previous generations, albeit with newly released processors to power the Inspiron 153505. With that said, the laptop offers an IPS panel, SSD support, snappy processors of choice, and a proven design. The latter ensures minimum financial effort and maximum yield. It seems like Dell has reused an older chassis for Inspiron 153505's build. It is made of plastic and leaves something to be desired when it comes to rigidity. On the other hand, its weight of under 2 kg and profile slimmer than 20 mm make it a fairly portable device. A rare sight in this class is the addition of a fingerprint reader, located on the power button. Weirdly enough, this laptop lacks a USB Type-C port. However, you get three USB Type-A ports, two 3.2 Generation 1 and one 2.0. Also, there is an HDMI 1.4 connector, a LAN port, an audio jack, and a power plug. Here, you can fit up to 32GB of DDR4 RAM, thanks to two SOTOM slots. In addition, there is one M2 slot for storage, as well as a 2.5-inch SATA slot with the connector being included. If you want to see how to open the laptop, you can check out our teardown video. Only 2 per 100 people watching this video are subscribers. If you decide to just start following us, we'll be able to reinvest more in our laboratory thus making even more helpful videos for you. Thank you, you're awesome. This laptop's 1080p IPS panel has wide viewing angles and a good contrast ratio of 1070 to 1. Unfortunately, it covers only 51% of the sRGB gamut, meaning that the picture looks a bit dull. On the bright side, you won't be suffering from the negative effects of PWM, because the display doesn't flicker at any brightness level. Battery-wise we are talking about a 42 watt hours unit that delivers about 8 hours of web browsing, or a bit more than 7 hours of video playback. Good results. As we said, the Inspiron 153505 features processors from a bit old lineup. The top configuration here includes the Ryzen 5 3450U with only integrated graphics available. This laptop is not necessarily a beast when it comes to performance. On the other hand, you will surely get a snappy experience. Moreover, it will be comfortable as well, since the keyboard's hotspot keeps just below 40 degrees during sustained load. Dell has taken a different approach with this device. Instead of pushing for the latest and greatest technology, they offer a sensible solution. Its idea is to give more people the chance of owning a laptop. At the same time, the Inspiron 153505 is actually a pretty solid machine. Its upgradability and IPS display are easily the highlights of the model. If you'd like to find more information about this machine, you can see all of the tests we performed in our in-depth review. The link is in the video description below.